Hello everybody, welcome to this exciting episode of Bob the Sign Man. Today, we're going to do something entirely different. It's never been performed before in the history of sign making. Well, at least I think it hasn't been. I have uh, several no parking signs to make. We're going to make some and we're going to install them out in this area in Napa. It's by a flea market and they don't want parking on Sundays um, from 5 a.m. to 5 p.m. without a permit because it just it chokes up, they overflow on the outside and they, they choke up the area. Anyways, so with this exciting episode, we're going to make the no parking signs and then below it is going to say, uh, you know, accept by permit and yada, yada, yada. Anyways, so we're going to try something different today. We, I mean the Bob the Side Man and my assistant, Jose, we're going to try something that's never been done before. At least I think it has, like I said before. We're going to cover oh, DG3, nine sign blanks, we're going to tape them all together, and we're going to run it through and we're going to cover nine signs, yeah, nine signs at a time. We're going to try this run and see what happens. you got to stay tuned for this exciting episode. It's totally groundbreaking and revolutionary. It's going to just totally turn the sign making business upside down. All righty. Without further ado, let's get into nine at a time. Yeah, here's part of our first attempt at a never performed stunt before. We're going to cut out nine signs at the same time. The important thing is the layout. So we're going to do no parking Sunday, 5 a.m. to 5 p.m. It's for flea market out here in Napa. And we're going to try to cut all these out and lay them on a sign blank nine at a time and see what happens. The important first step in this stunt is always your layout. All right, here's the first important step in cutting out our nine at a time. We're going to start by cutting out the red EC film. And while we're doing that, or while this is cutting, Jose will be over there covering up nine sign blanks with some DG3 from 3M products. Okay, here we are back in the sign shop, working on our nine sign at a time stunt. I got Jose here, he's go ahead and he's gonna weed out all the uh, material here on the EC fill. Say hi to everybody, Jose. <laughs> all right, carry on. Okay, here we are, all nine joined together as you can see. And we're gonna put some transfer tape on those and then we're gonna try to run all nine of them over the top of some sign blanks. I have the sign blank here. And I think what we're gonna try to do is tape them together, tape all nine together. And then we're gonna lay our overlay over the top of them and see how it turns out. All right, here's another step. We have all nine sign blanks taped together from the back side. And we made sure that the uh, transfer pattern is gonna fit all of them just exactly right. You might have to move some of them around, tape them in. We're going to flip this over and we're going to put transfer tape on those and we'll see what happens. Okay, I think if we go ahead, we can roll this. Get the tape. The light up over there, fine? Yeah. Alright. Go ahead and uh, you pull or pull? You pull. Good, you got the pressure just right. Yep, right. PSI. Okay, let's do it. Pull and see what happens. Alright, they're coming out good. Uh, even feeling. Oh, yeah, this is gonna be a good one. Coming out. And those are it. Time to cut. All we have to do is trim it out and lay it out now. Alright. Now let's get these. Carefully. Carefully. It's going to get stuck on that end over there. 
necessary. These are looking good down here. Uh, these are, yeah, they're better now. I mean, right, watch your fingers. I need to know what it is. Let's go. Halfway, let's see what we got. Looks good here. This is what we've been training for. <laughs> <sighs> now we're nothing, Bob. Well, yep. see now what happens. Edge just yet. Let's get it. You want, Bob, you want push it forward and then go forward. There you go. Uh oh. No, yeah, get it on the bar. What's happening? All right. Nine at a time. <laughs> Remember, you saw it here first on Bob the Sight Man. <laughs> I don't think I don't want to do this again. No? I don't know. It's a lot of setup. But we, there's only time to go. Yeah, nine at once. Nope, it's I'm... never been done ever that I've seen. Well, first time here. Are you, are you ready to unpeel this? Yeah. All right. There's one. There's two. 
two. perfect signs. Well that was a lot of setup and work. I think it's, I don't know, by the time you do each one individually or you put them all together. Uh, I think it's, uh, if we're doing a bunch of signs for a certain row and you get done fast, I think it pays off because you get all done at one time. But it would be cool to time it and see how long it would take to do this versus, the versus individually. But it was exciting for Bob the Sign Man. <laughs> Exclusive here on Bob the Sign Man. Nine signs. Yeah, nine signs at a time. Never before done. Well, I've never seen it done before. Is it worth the time and effort? Yes, it can be. Uh, just remember, myself and Jose are trained professionals. Do not try this, attempt to try this stunt at home. It just, it, it could go bad really quick. Um, uh, you know, if you do them one at a time, it's going to take you nine times longer than it did to do nine at one time. So it's, you know, six of one, half a dozen to the other. It, we don't know. We just don't know. But um, like I said, um, doing the nine at a time, you have to be really careful because one little mistake and you could lose a lot of your, your, your time and everything by doing them, you know, singly, singular, singly, whatever. Um, but I think it, it was kind of exciting for, you know, a little episode here of, you know, never done before, ever attempted before. Uh, you know, I, I can't emphasize enough, do not try this stunt at home. Alrighty, as always, thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time on Bob the Sign Man.